What does that taste like? Is it good? morning from the car you guys it's a rainy day again I feel like I'm always reporting the weather at the beginning of every vlog and that's totally not intentional it just is kind of like it's that time of year where if you live in the tornado zone it's like you have to be paying attention to the weather so it happened again we're under tornado watch today I was editing the vlog when I got the notification and I knew I was gonna go need to get lunch and so I was like do I finish editing the vlog or do I go out now when it's not real bad outside. So I know a lot of you guys are not from areas that had tornadoes, so tornado watch is like the less severe time. Like it's, it basically just means like the atmosphere is right for a tornado to happen. So it's like, you know, keep your guard up, be alert, but you don't need to be like in panic mode. Warning means panic mode, get to your basement. So um, when I say we're under tornado watch, it basically just means that there is a high chance that a tornado could happen, but it also very likely could not happen. So that's kind of where we're at right now. And I was like, probably should go get food while we're under watch because if it gets to warning, then I'm not gonna be leaving the house. I've just been really bad about getting groceries lately and I'm like super craving that Jimmy John's lettuce wrap again. The one that I get, cause some of you guys have asked, the one that I get is the beach club sandwich or unwitch, the lettuce wrap, it is so good. It's got like um, turkey, cheese, avocado, and then obviously lettuce and I think mayo or something. I don't know. It's really, really good. So I'm going to just go grab that for a quick lunch. I really did not have time today to make anything or get to the store this morning. So that's the plan. What's up guys? So I just got done getting a little bit ready for the day. This has been kind of like my go-to look lately. I haven't been wearing lashes and my natural lashes have been a lot better than normal i think it's just because i'm not completely messing them up and getting like lash glue and all kinds of crap on them we haven't talked too much about it yet i think we've mentioned it a couple times in the vlog but here in about two weeks maybe a little more or less i don't know exactly how many days we are going to north carolina i've been kind of like toying with the idea of getting lash extensions before we go because I don't know, when you're traveling, like the last thing you wanna do is just spend your entire trip getting ready. And I was like, it might make it easier if I just have lash extensions so I don't have to do so much makeup and whatever. So I thought about it and I wanna know, I'm sure some of you guys have had them that watch the vlog. I wanna know what your experience with them is because I've heard really great stories and some people like can't live without them. And then I've also heard some stories of them completely tearing people's lashes up. I'm kind of curious, I don't know. I just wanna know what you guys think. I actually have never gotten them before and I just thought it would be really great before a trip or something just so that that's one less thing in your makeup routine you have to worry about because for me, like the bare minimum, if I just have mascara and eyebrows on, I can live with it. Does anybody else like prioritize their time getting ready like that? For me, my eyebrows, take the longest and then second to that obviously is winged liner and then you know kind of like contouring blush foundation stuff i'll always say like fill in the blank however much time i have okay this is how long it takes me to do this this and this so i have to like pick and choose what to do i don't know am i the only one who does that we have some more fun plans for this weekend we are actually going out on the lake on monday assuming the weather permits i think it should be good i am going to paint my toenails it's like little things that you think about like that when you're going to do stuff like okay I'm going on the lake I'm probably gonna be wearing sandals okay my toes are gonna be showing I'm just getting all kinds of personal with you guys on things that just go on inside my brain so I'm like I better get my toenails painted before we go out on the lake and I'm wearing sandals and look all you know nasty I also have a fresh tan on which is always a good thing. I haven't done a whole lot today just because it's been rainy, the weather's been terrible, so I've pretty much just edited the vlog, hung out with Lacey, and gotten ready, but uh, yeah, just little things to do today. Kind of relaxing, I've been really, really busy 
um, the last several days. We've had a lot of plans, a lot of things going on, so it's nice to have a day just to kind of chill and relax and have more free time than normal to do things that I want to do. So I'm trying to utilize Lazy's nap time the best that I can for a little me time. Hey, baby girl. You're not that hurt. You had a little scratch. Daisy, get down. <laughs> she wants to give you some love, huh? Daisy. <laughs> All right, let's see the Band-Aid. Who's on the Band-Aid? Say it louder. Marlin and Nemo? She's grumpy, guys, excuse that. We've had kind of a grumpy past two days, so she hasn't been on the vlog that much. Isn't that right? <laughs> yeah, you've been kind of having a rough time. Are you hungry? What do you want to eat? You want a sandwich again? Even though that's what you had for lunch? Yeah. You sure? Uh-huh. Daisy, leave her alone. The funniest thing ever just happened. We're getting some, like, snacks. Yeah. And I... I know some people think this is absolutely disgusting, and I kind of even do too, but it's all we had. Um, I got some tuna out, and I don't think that Lacey has ever tried tuna before. <laughs> I gave her a bite, and I said, oh, do you like that tuna? And she goes, taste chicken. What does that taste like? Is it good? What do you think it tastes like? Does it taste like chicken? She's like, I'll stick with my sandwich, thank you very much. What did we just get done doing, Lace? Mm -hmm. Did we paint your sweet little piggy toes? Can we see? Oh, it's so bright the camera can't even pick up the color. There we go. Look at those cute little piggies. Mama's toenails match. This is the color we used. I feel like they've changed this color in recent years, but it's Flip Flop Fantasy by China Glaze. And then I just use the SE gel top coat. Do you love your pink piggies? Yeah. Are they so cute? You want to watch the show, Pony? You want to watch the Pony show? Where's she gone? Matching. up here at the store getting some food. Those balloons are so cute. I got one for Lacey a while back, it was an elephant, but I hadn't seen the zebra, that was really cute. Getting some dinner, uh, getting some groceries, and then headed home, probably headed out. Next time you'll see me, I'll be with Greg out DJing at the club, at the bar, should be fun. So I'm not buying these, but do you remember these as kids? I used to eat these all the time. Just brownies and puddings and corn. This little guy is evil. Brock is live on Instagram right now. And I'm actually just editing the vlog today, but him and his friend, well, he, Brock's not DJing, his friend is. This is Greg, this is who he went to see tonight. 